How's it going, YouTube? This is Clone Wars 22 bringing you another Star Wars The Clone Wars action figure review today. And today I will be reviewing the Star Wars The Clone Wars uh, Republic, Tro Republic Troopers Battle Pack. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, ooh, which one am I going to review first? Uh, we'll start from left to right. Okay, first up we've got. Star Wars, The Clone Wars, Republic, Clone Trooper, Hard Case, yes. This figure is related to, the sculpt is related to the Commander Stone sculpt, so nothing too exciting. Um, well, we'll start off, you pretty much know what the articulation is for most, for the Commander Stone sculpt, but we'll do it anyways. Um, starting off, he has a ball jointed head, sadly no, or no removable helmet. Well, hopefully we may get a phase two one of this guy. So we have ball joint ball jointed shoulders, ball jointed elbows, and swivel wrists. Yes, those swivel wrists. Evil things. I don't really like them that much. And then we have swivel thighs, ball jointed knees and new articulation in the Angles, so sadly to say, but he does have a pretty awesome 501st paint job. Very neat. Nothing too messy. Nothing too much on the back, other than the fact that his fin is crooked. Um, bend that back. We have uh, the blue paint back there, and then we have a little tiny bit of blue painting right there. Very cool. Very cool. Um. We have, that's pretty much it for hard case. Um, we'll do the cards at the end. So there's hard case. Second of, we have the, after how many seasons of waiting, years of waiting for this guy. Finally, we have the Bomb Squad Trooper. Wow. Thanks, Ashbro. You took, it took you a million years to do. But, um, yeah, finally we have him. Uh, we have... Same articulation for the other figure for same as hard case. Um, we've got a really nice uh, ball. It's like a bombshell and a little bit of fire there, flames. But good painting there. Very nice paint job, Hasbro. Thank you. Then we have the bomb squad paint job here. Nothing inaccurate so far. Very nice. Very nice orange painting pretty much everywhere on this figure but the Hasbro released their they nothing messy really everything's very clean cut um have a little bit of white there a little bit of white there so it's nothing wrong we got orange feet there hmm. very nice very nice if I say do say so myself but um yep uh phase one armor no removable helmet, so yeah. Sadly to say too. That'd been kinda cool if they had um removable helmets. Put him back there. And last but not least, we have uh clone trooper cadet cut up. Or should I just say clone cadet cut up in his cadet armor? Uh Pretty much the same. Pretty much right now, he is the same exact thing. Hold on, real fast. As the clone cadet heavy, man, they really need to release a clone trooper heavy, not a clone cadet. So here's the cut up. Here's heavy. Pop their helmets off. They are the same thing, except for some reason, cut up has like red eyes. <laughs> Kind of weird. You can see right there. <sighs> same thing with the helmets. The helmets are the same. You can't really tell the difference. You can't tell the difference at all. So we're not reviewing heavy, so we'll get heavy off to the side. Uh, he has the same articulation as the clone cadet heavy. Uh, ball jointed head. We've got ball jointed shoulders. Kind of stiff, but that's good. Ball jointed elbows. Swivel wrists. Swivel hip. Uh, <laughs> I finally got it. But, um, 
We have swivel thighs, ball jointed knees, and non articulated uh, ankles, so whatever. Um, he's got the number four right there painted under there. Only difference, to, another difference is the number, his is 4040. Uh, and then his is seven eight three. Um, yeah. Then he's number one. He's number four. He's got a f big four in the back. Uh, same paint job there. Very nice. Very nice. Yep. There's cut up. You take a nice look at him. Now we are going into the. Won't talk about them too much. The Galactic Battle Game cards. Uh, so we'll start off as in order. Got Clone Trooper Hardcase. There's the back. And then here's the the card, the numbers, powers, whatever. Life forces. His force ability. Okay, whatever. Um, Bomb Squad Trooper. Very nice. I, I don't know. Okay, yeah, that's the blue shadow virus. There's the blue shadow virus. Another picture there, too. The powers here. Life force is luck. Put that there. We've got clone cadet cut up. And the life force, the force, like all the powers up here. Life force is leadership. Okay. There are the cards. And then it comes with one a uh, game die, the uh, play your game if you want to play it. And then the uh, accessories are a DC-15 blaster rifle and two DC-15 blasters. I don't know if you guys want to correct me in the comments below, you can. Uh, okay, for the the ratings out of 10, I would have to give this battle pack, the Republic Troopers, a... A nine and a half. The reason I give it a nine and a half, not a complete ten, is they did use the Commander Stone sculpt for these two figures here, which is not the best sculpt made by Hasbro. I don't know why. Maybe my only reasons are cheaper to make. Maybe more mass production. They can make more at a cheaper rate. Uh, yep. And sadly. Another reason why it's a 9.5 out of 10 is they made a cadet version. I'm not a big fan of the cadet versions. I like the clone troopers, not the cadet versions of of cut up. They shouldn't have made a clone trooper cut up. Um, but I do definitely recommend you buying this battle pack. Even though it is worth, they've brought the price. They did have four clone troopers at once for $24.99 I think it was. Then they brought it down to three, but they lowered it the price to nineteen ninety nine, and I think they went up again to. Uh, yeah, it was a while since I bought this. Uh, what was it? I want to say they went back to twenty three ninety nine. It is now. If you guys want to post comments below about how much it is now, because I don't exactly remember. Sorry about this, guys. I don't have my facts straight, but definitely is a good battle pack. Uh, please, if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe to my channel. Check out my other reviews. That'd be really cool if you guys could do that. Thanks for your time, and good luck finding this battle pack and other Star Wars and Clone Wars figures. Thanks, guys. Clone Wars 22 signing out.